I recently took over maintenance on a site that I did not build or put together. And so I was a little bit confused because it looked like a lot of the meta information was coming from all different sorts of places. And so I just thought I'd go ahead and do a quick tutorial on how I have used JSiteMap Pro to organize the information. You can see that in just core Joomla articles that there's an opportunity for you to enter meta information in the publishing tab. We have a meta description here and meta keywords. Additionally, meta information can be put into the menu area as well. And you can see that meta information can be put here, meta description, meta keywords. And in the case of the site that I took over, there was also additional components that had meta information. This can get kind of confusing having the meta information in so many different spots and not really being able to control it. So I looked at a lot of different options. And for me, since most of the sites I manage already use JSiteMap Pro, to manage the sitemap, uh, it, it just made sense to go with something that I'm already using. So let's take a look at J Sitemap Pro and let's go to the search engines meta info. And when you do that, uh, it sort of comes up blank with all my pages. So I'm able to go ahead and auto populate it with information that's already there can also maintain the meta information in an external file where I can import and export a course. And now you can see that from the various entries, it is auto populated. Um, and I had done some testing on this test site before where I had put a description in the article content and this one's in the menu. And so I've gone ahead and done that. And so I can go ahead and save that now, save it all. And then here is now where I'm going forward, going to enter my information. Now, the one thing of note is that when I do make these changes here, it does not make the changes. For instance, if I made a change here, it won't go forward and change the article uh, content information or the menu information. It does save it all right here, but in my testing uh, on the front end, it will go ahead and publish the new information. So I'm going to go ahead and change this one about flower, and I'm going to change the uh, information here. So that I can go ahead and save it and show you on the front end. And now, as you can see in the source code of Flowers page, the meta description has changed the information.